Hi, I'm Shauna Lee, and today this is going to be a different video. I'm, it's not going to be the traditional like sit down and chit chat type video because I have been like obsessing over thrift shopping lately and it's a problem. <laughs> but um, I basically, I want to show you guys what I got and um, I didn't record like inside stores because every time I went it was like super crowded and stuff but I did get like a clip of like the outside of the store not not that good I know but um yeah let's just get into the haul <laughs> okay so first of all I'm gonna start with the clothes that are in my ghetto basement bathroom that no one uses <laughs> this is basically like my little center where I steam stuff and take photos of stuff and all that I even have like a little hook on the wall and yeah, I'm gonna try to avoid showing the floor because the floor has a bunch of like stuff all over it, like painting supplies and stuff that still need to be moved out of here. So it's still kind of messy in here, but it's we use it's usable basically for what I need it for. So let's just look at what I have hanging here. So basically, this is stuff that I um want to steam and all that. So these are just like waiting to be steamed. And then I'm gonna like photograph them and all that stuff. By the way, um, I'm, I have like a Poshmark store that I started and that's gonna be linked down below. Um, that's basically why I'm doing this. I should have mentioned that before, but whatever. Okay, so we have this beautiful Michael Kors blouse. Excuse all these random hangers right there. But um, yes, this is like a really pretty blue and the there's like cuffs with like buttons and stuff and it's so pretty i love this and there were stains on the cuffs but i think i got them out i can't remember which cuff it was but i don't see the stains anymore i think they were like coffee stains or something oh and by the way this is a bathtub um please excuse that <laughs> anyways um yes yeah, so this is a really nice blouse it feels really nice and it is a large Michael Kors thing. So yay, I like that. And then this is what, Lula Rose? Yeah, or Lula Row blouse type thing. I don't know what to call it, but it's, oh, my finger, go away finger. I don't know what to call this. It's a basically short sleeve type shirt thing. And it's all sparkly. There's like a black base to it. I think it's really pretty. And it's like really long too. This is also large. And I have a lot of larges. This is like a turtleneck type thing. It's new with tags. So I picked it up. Um, uh, It's only Croft and Barrow. So it's not really like an expensive shirt. But it was new with tags. So I figured it couldn't hurt to buy it. And it's cute. Like look at all these snowflakes. I like these. And they're like blue and stuff. I feel like that's, that would be really nice for like the holiday season. And then I got this uh, NFL team apparel Chicago Bears shirt. My mom is a Chicago Bears fan and I thought she would like it, but it is too small for her. It is a medium. Yeah, it's medium. So she, yeah, and unfortunately she does not fit into it. So I'm just going to sell it. But I think it's like a nice graphic. There's like a like a raw like V cut into it. She actually thought that like it was it was like torn or whatever. But if you look, like it's actually knitted like that. So it's not torn. <laughs> and then I have this Banana Republic black long sleeve, maybe like quarter sleeve shirt. And um it's a small there we go, small. And by the way, all these will be going up in my shop fairly soon. So if you're interested in any any of these, they will be up on there. And there's other stuff that I've already posted that I won't show in this video. So if you want to check out that stuff, you can. But yes, yeah, so this and this might show up better like in, in the photos online anyways, because there's like details that you might not be able to see. I can't tell though if it's showing up on the camera. But yes, it's very thin. So it might be a good idea to like wear a tank top or something underneath it. But like, as you can see, you can see like the shirt behind it through the back. So, but it's like very nice feeling. I like it. And then I got this Team Apparel NFL Cardinals shirt. This one's more of a slick material. And I love this. I felt like this was really cute. And I love the glitter 
And I don't know, I wish I was a Cardinals fan so I could wear this, <laughs> but it's a small, it probably wouldn't fit me anyways, but I really like that. I feel like that's super cute and I love the little ties and stuff. And it's in really good condition, so that's also nice. I love when things are in good condition. Makes me happy. Okay, and then we have some stuff going on right here. One sec. Okay, so this, um, I don't even know. It was new with tags, so I picked it up. Um, probably shouldn't pick up everything new with tags, but yeah, it still has its tags. And I, I honestly don't know. I guess athletic department is just like a gray t-shirt. I couldn't even tell you like what it would be from. But uh, yeah, it's um, alternative apparel, so I don't even know. I'll probably sell it for like $18 because I don't even know. <laughs> and then I have this Lauren Conrad like really thin blouse. Um, it buttons up and I really like that black trim. I feel like it's so nice and this is an extra small, but I feel like that is so pretty. That is, I don't know, I love blue. I love floral type stuff like this. It's really nice. And then this is a Lisa International gold sparkly blouse thing in medium. Um, and like the sides have like a little tie, or not tied, like a cinched side. I think it's both sides. Yeah, it's both sides. There's like cinched nest going on. I feel like this would be really, really pretty to some sort of fancy occasion especially during like Christmas time like this would be gorgeous and as you can see the inside isn't sparkly so only the outside scratchy <laughs> but and it is long sleeve so that makes it nice too and we have an ugly shower curtain ugly shower curtain <laughs> but yeah I feel like that's really nice and let's go over here to these things that I have hanging waiting to be dealt with um this is a east fifth small uh, embroidered blouse thing. Um, I, I picked this up because I just love the embroidery on it. I feel like it's really pretty. Um, I don't know if it's really like worth anything, but I don't, I don't know. I thought it was pretty. I feel like it's kind of vintage looking and it looks kind of old too. Like it, the tag looks a little bit like worn, but yes, this is a small if I didn't mention that before, but I don't know. I feel like this would complement my body. I'm not going to keep it, but I think it would compliment my body. <laughs> and then I have this uh, St. John's Bay uh, men's sweater. And it is in, uh, it's uh, 2XL. And it's new tags. Yay! And I love when the original price is on there because that makes it a lot easier for me. And it's funny because I went back to the same Goodwill that I went to like before and um, I checked the men's section because this was in the women's section for whatever reason. But I went in the men's section and I found the exact same sweater, new tags, same size, except it was like brown or gray. But that's, that's what I picked up today. So I'll show that in a second. I think it was brown, maybe, I can't remember, but literally the same exact thing. So I thought that was so cool. So someone probably didn't want both of those sweaters, but for whatever reason, they put them in different sections. So, and I think the price was taken off of the other one, maybe. So I guess this will help too, so then I know what the original price was. But it's really nice, I love it. Yeah, it's a cotton and cashmere sweater, so that's probably why it feels so like nice. It's really soft, but yeah, I like it. Okay, and then I also have, these aren't, these probably aren't going to go up right away, but um, I have some Rock Revival jeans. They are, like, not very, like, flattered on this, um, but they're really nice jeans. They retail for, like, about, like, $160. Really expensive jeans that I've had for, like, ever, so I'll probably post those at some point. And then these are, um, like, extra small Nike shorts that are just black and white. Um, let me see what size these Rock Revival jeans are. Oh, and there's like sequins on the pants and they're gray, which is really nice. They are size 27. So I guess that's something to look forward to if you're a size 27 and if you want those. Um, I might price them at like $65 and then if people want to offer something lower, they can. Which I'm open to offers too. So if there's anything you like just make an offer I guess but obviously make it like to where it's reasonable but you know <laughs> and 
And then we have my steamer. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's go upstairs and look at the other stuff because that's pretty much it that's down here. So yay! So I basically decided to just bring the stuff down here because it was literally only three things and I was like, you know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna bring it down. But this is the brown sweater that I was talking about where it's like literally the same as that sweater and same size and everything. Tag and this one actually does not have the retail price, but it's literally the same exact thing. So I'll just use the same retail, retail price, which was... $40. So yeah, it's literally the same exact thing. So I think that's perfect. And it's super soft like the other ones. So I'm okay with that. <laughs> and then this one, uh, this one was my other uh, new tags purchase that I got today. And I love how there's like buttons down like the sides and stuff. And they're just like decorative buttons. They don't really function at all. But this one is also that St. John's Bay uh uh, company or whatever there it is okay losing my mind I thought the tag was like on the inside of the shirt but it was on the sleeve but the original price was torn off so I might research or I might just price it the same as the other sweaters but I love it I love like the top of it and it's so like sparkly too it's like a sparkly uh cream color and this would be a really nice sweater for like the um Winter, there we go. <laughs> and that's a size medium. And then this is the other thing that I got. It's just a Pokemon, it's just a Pokemon shirt. I thought that was really cute. I love how there's like the different like types of balls and stuff all over, Pokeballs, etc. blah, blah, blah. Um, and it is an extra large 100% cotton t-shirt. And I thought the design was also in really good condition. Like there's no cracks in the, um, the print which is really cool because I it, it says that it was printed in 2016. So I feel like that's pretty good for being a few years old. So yeah, I like it. And it's just a black t-shirt. I think that's black. Yeah, that's black. It almost looked like a navy blue for a second there, but it's it's black. It might look navy, navy blue in the lighting, but whatever. It's black, I think. <laughs> I know, I sound so confident. <laughs> I also have like a, a bunch of stuff in my closet and I'm not sure if I'm going to show that stuff in this video, but I might, I don't know. I might save it for like a future video because it's, I think it's going to be too dark if I try to l directly show you guys out of my closet. So maybe I'll just make a separate video sometime in the future, but I feel like this is a good like amount of clothing items. Um, yeah, I have a lot of new tag stuff too, which is really cool. I didn't think I'd be able to find so many new tag things. So yeah, um, I guess I'll close out the video now. <laughs> okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed shopping and making this video and all that. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the thrifting content. I, I definitely enjoy it. I feel like I have fun with it and stuff. So yeah, there might be more of these coming <laughs> soon in the future, especially since I have a bunch of clothes upstairs that I could probably show you guys. But um, I'll just stick with this for now and I'll see what you guys think of it and all that. And yeah, if you want to see more videos like this or haul videos, story time videos, food videos, more videos like that, uh, leave a like and comment and subscribe. Um, comment if you like have any good thrift stores in your area and like what kind of stuff you guys are able to find. Like, are you guys able to find new tag stuff as easily? Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!